y'all. Welcome back to the Wednesday the Reboot. Today, boom. You already saw it because you clicked on it. The shade turret. Yeah. I did a little uh, thing on Instagram a while back where I was like, ooh, look what I got today. It's in one of my posts. How much dust on this? I was saying, I'm only had it for a week. But I'm going to open up today, do some shots today. And yeah, at the end, there's going to be toy photography. So without further ado, I have um, a bunch. Of, I don't have any around me. But these orange guys right here. Well, they're red in this one, but I have some orange ones. They're super articulated. So I'm guessing that this is going to be exactly the same. Now, I did buy two of these because I want two. I don't want just one. I want two. But I want two for a shot so it looked cooler in a, in a toy photography. Because so I'm going to take it outside on the stump and do some stuff. Make you guys always see all my outside stuff. But, yeah, let's open this thing up. Maybe I can give you guys, like, a how-to on how to put it together or something like that. This is not a review. I'm not a good at reviewing. So there's tons of talented people out there that can do the reviews for you, like I always say. But yeah, let's check out Little Guy, though. And this thing's pretty big. And also, you get to see all the other cool stuff. Like, there's a gun goose on there. Um, I also have that pack with the two bad guys and then the clear. It's not on here. But yeah, I haven't seen that one in stores yet, the yellow one. I've seen a couple of these yet in store. This wave yet. So the individual figure wave, I haven't seen, I don't think I've seen any of those individually yet. So if you see them, grab them up. They're really cool. I mean, 10 bucks, 10 bucks. And this one was actually weathered up by Gorilla Customs, but look at that. Look how nice it is. And he just did a quick wash on that and it looks great. I mean, for him, it's a quick wash. It would take me forever, but he's super talented. So he's a little fascinating, but this guy right here, the little guy comes with it. He has a little tiny gun, so I don't want to be too crazy ripping this thing open. But yeah, show this little little handheld space pistol. Look at that space pistol. Thing's pretty dope. Sweet. Got a lot of detail on it too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Looks good. Um, he has a different backpack thing. He looks more. Um, oh, what are the red and silver guys called? The ghost. What's the ghost? What was the ghost called? It's a certain thing. Dang it. But yeah. Banshee. Ban banished. He, yeah, he has like a more of a banished look. He has like the banished paint job. So I don't know if we're going to be seeing him in the new game. Or, obviously. We're going to be we're gonna be seeing some of these guys in the new game, right? So yeah, that's what he looks like. And when I say that they're super articulated, like these guys can really move. Now, look at the wrists and stuff. Everything has like full movement down here the f the ankle rocker if he even had an ankle it's just really cool i just yeah you can do crazy wild yeah these guys really are articulated like i said you can grab up most of the halo stuff for 10 bucks a pop so that's super duper cheap anywho let's jump into this so we got the round thing Let's see if we should put stuff on it first, though. We literally destroyed this box. It has directions, too. Alright, there's directions. But let's just look at it. See if it makes sense. So, you had two different ends on this. The bigger of the ends. It's gonna go in here. Smaller one's gonna go here. There's a little spot right there for it. Now I don't know if the glass actually sits on those or not. So same thing on the other side. Big end up here. It's like I just created a tutorial. I wasn't actually gonna put this together. I was just gonna show you guys if I liked it or not. It's definitely a lot of toy for 20 bucks. You get a figure too, and this, this is gonna be cool. Uh, front one. Does the round part go up? Guess how I do it. I don't use directions. Round part on the top. So somehow this round part needs to go up there. I mean, you should use directions though, if you want. Oh, and that slides over that. You see? See, there's little pegs that go right around those posts, that the roundy post. Little pegs right in there that hold it. 
Huh? Look at that. Didn't need the directions. Um, next up, what are we going to do about this piece? These piece. I assume they also go on there. Let's look at the box. This one might be a little bit harder. But we're good. We're fine. Oh, duh. There's a thing right here. There we go. Snap right on. Sometimes on the Halo stuff, the Jazz Wars stuff, like when I go like this, hey, they both click. Sometimes one side will click, the other side won't on some stuff. And you're like, oh no, but it still works the same. But it is nice to hear that clicking noise. And then uh, we're just going to put the base on. Okay. Yeah, like that. Is that right? Oh, these go up. Ah! How's it only go side to side, which would have been cool too. All right, and then you just put guy in the middle. Boop, boop. Looks like he fits in there pretty darn well. And then the little pedals come up to him. So you can even put like a Spartan in there and stuff. Like on the game when you can like take it over. Well, I don't know about this game, but in previous games when you take over like the weapons. But look at that thing. That is super fancy and cool for 20 bucks. And you get a little guy. Like if this was, I would pay 30 bucks for this. Shh, don't hear that. Don't listen, Jazzwares. This is super hard to get, $20. No, 20 bucks is cool for a whole like little play set type thing. And you could even repaint this, which I'll probably do because I just like my own style on stuff that's already well done. But you don't have to, it's already that good. But yeah, look at that. And these move, boom, 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 boom. This whole thing spins. And if you have it up farther, it won't hit the thing. I don't know how. Here we go. Look at that. It spins all the way around. So that is pretty cool. That is the shade turret. Fancy pants jazz wears. They be killing it. Look out for jazz wears. Even in the wrestling figures. And I just started collecting wrestling figures again. But I'll stop talking. I hope you guys had a good day. I hope this video was fun, and I hope these toy photos that I haven't taken yet that you're about to see as soon as I'm done talking are awesome. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Remember to be kind to one another. And if you guys want, um, I don't know if this is enough right here of me showing you stuff, or if you guys want it out in front of me, because I can do that too, where I switch and turn the camera around. Like when it's a custom, I really want to show you, but like this, I'm pretty sure you guys can figure it out. I mean, I could do like. Just let me know if you guys, I mean, whatever. I know like only 100 people watch this stuff anyway, but I appreciate you guys. But yeah, if you guys want anything different, just let me know. And yeah, I can flip it around. This is just easier to show you and show you guys my face and my difficulties trying to put things together. But this thing is really cool. It's pretty durable too. So let's see. Turn upside down. So yeah. Bam! No, I'm just kidding. Uh, anywho, have a good day. Remember, be kind to one another, and uh, check out the Instagram. If you guys aren't watching this on Instagram, and you're on YouTube right now, and you're seeing this, check out the Instagram, because I'm posting every single day. So if you're like, oh man, where has he been on YouTube? I'm doing stories and lives and everything else right there on Instagram. So come hang out with the Instagram fam, if you are not watching this on Instagram. If you're on Instagram, what's up? What's up, Instagram? How are you guys doing? What's up, IGTV? Anywho, have a good day. Again, be kind of one another. Toy photos! Toy photos now! Pete, Cortana says to get to the bridge, double quick.
messy desk so I could show you guys like a more detailed look if you want but I would do it over in the area where we shoot like if you guys have seen before just didn't, not sure if you want something like this but hey might as well right right so you could have him with like one hand and then one hand holding one of these like maybe shooting behind him because let's say a Spartan jumps over let's say Spartan goes jumps over and then they're like ah trying to shoot him he could then reach back with this little guy and be like beep, beep, and then knock him down you know what i'm saying yeah but look at all the detail i thought it was really cool to show you guys i think this thing is just wonderful this is a really cool toy if you're on the fence about it don't be go grab one up that's just some d like me i grabbed two of them i grabbed the only two i saw and i am not sad about it but look at all the details guys anywho